What's up everyone, Take Down here. Welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna to be talking about what to do if your PlayStation 5 is experiencing a network error and is not connecting to Wi-Fi. Let's get right into this. So if you are getting a network error, the first thing to do is to check the status of the PlayStation Network to see if it is down or if there is some kind of outage. If the PlayStation Network doesn't appear to be down, check to see if your Wi-Fi is working on other devices, your laptop, phone, other consoles. If it isn't, try rebooting your internet. If other devices are working, the next easy thing to try is to move your PlayStation 5 closer to the modem to get a stronger signal. If that didn't work, try restarting starting your PlayStation 5 in safe mode. This isn't any kind of factory reset. This is just going into safe mode to do a restart because that is a better method of restarting your console. To do this, you're gonna make sure your PlayStation 5 is turned off. You're then gonna press and hold the power button until you hear two beeps. Your PlayStation 5 should turn on and launch into safe mode. You're gonna now want to connect your controller to your PlayStation 5. And within safe mode, you're gonna select option one to restart the console. And again, this is just going to restart the console. It's not gonna do any kind of reset or factory reset. You're not gonna lose anything. Now, if that didn't work, next, make sure your PlayStation 5 has the current updates. If your PlayStation 5 isn't up to date, you won't have access to anything online. If your PlayStation 5 is up to date, the next thing to do is to set up your Wi-Fi connection manually. To do this, you're gonna go into settings, then network settings. Next, you're going to set up the internet connection and then you're gonna select manually. You're gonna go through all of the steps and you're going to enter your own Wi-Fi info. Now, whenever you get into the DNS settings, you can try changing it to a different server. The best one and the one that most people recommend is Google server, which is primary 8.8.8.8 .8 and the secondary is 8.8.4.4. .4. I did make a video talking about DNS error issues if you are experiencing a DNS issue, but this video we were talking about in general network errors on the PlayStation 5. So by changing your DNS server to Google's or other ones, hopefully that will work for you. Now once you are finished setting up your Wi-Fi manually, you are going to run a connection test to make sure that it is working and it does have a strong signal. Now once doing that, if still nothing I have mentioned works for you, the only other thing that you can try to do is a factory reset. Now you are going to lose everything, but if you have everything saved to the cloud, it's just a matter of re-downloading it again in the future. So unfortunately, there's no other real quick and easy fix if you are having a network error. If your Wi-Fi is working on other devices, the servers aren't down, and you did try everything else that I did mention in this video, nothing's working, the only other option is a factory reset. Now, with that being said, hopefully one of the options that I did mention in this video work for you and hopefully you can get on your PlayStation 5 without any kind of network error. If it did work for you, please leave a like and comment down below and I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.